Since taking office, the O'Neill Dion government was concerned that the quality of English in schools has dropped since the introduction of OBE and announced to do away with this curriculum next year. Member for Komo Magarima Francis Potape today asked the Prime Minister to inform the nation on the status of the transition from OBE to the new curriculum and when it would be ready for implementation. Prime Minister Peter O'Neill in response said, while his government's desire was to see OBE abolished as quickly as possible, this might not be achieved next year. The Minister is now working together with the development funds, in particular with the OSE, we requested them to help us put in a curriculum that we can fit it quickly because, uh, because uh, of, of the shortness of the timing that we have. So we are with the but I fear it might not be ready. He also raised concerns that the Education Department has not been supporting the government's move to abolish OBE. While responding to concerns raised on the leadership of this department, Mr. O'Neill said Dr. Musave Sinabare was suspended because he didn't show leadership in implementing the government's free education policy. He stressed that the nation demanded good leadership from this department and they must provide that leadership to the people of Papua New Guinea. Ruth Rungula, National MTV News.